morning everyone welcome back to a new vlog so woken up a bit earlier than I have been the past couple of days and I actually feel really good because of it I did go for a run last night though and my legs are absolutely killing me as well as my arms like even just holding my arm out to vlog right now huh it's like I'm in that much pain but it's gonna be worth it and actually it's the best run that I've done yet so I feel really good it's put me in a good mood and I've decided that I kind of wanted to start my new year now because every new year like everyone else I always have new year's resolutions and I never really stick to them and every year I say I'm gonna stick to it but I do actually think I am gonna stick to it I think because I'm doing the marathon I don't really have a choice but to stick to my goals so I really feel like next year is going to be the year for me and I'm going to start it today because why wait a week when I can just start it now so um I've been making some breakfast downstairs I'll show you in a second I got my nails done yesterday and I absolutely love the color my mum really hates it on me I knew when I picked this color I was going to go home and she's going to be like I really don't like that nail color on you and I was correct I don't know why, I don't know, maybe burgundy doesn't suit me, let me know what you think, and then I also got matching um, toenails as well, I also got my toenails painted burgundy, but every time I see this colour on everyone else, I absolutely love it, and I think it looks so nice, so I really wanted to get burgundy nails, so who knows, I'll probably, knowing me, I get my nails done so often, oh it hurts to squat. I'll probably be getting a new colour or getting them painted a different colour before you know it anyways. Um, anyways, yesterday when I went and got my nails done, I really quickly popped into town because I, I wanted to have a look at some of the sales stuff. But it was so busy so I really didn't stay very long. I did run into Vies though and I picked up these pyjamas I've wanted for ages. And they're just so cute and I love them and I'm just really happy because I wanted these for so long but they're so expensive. The top was, no, the bottoms were something like like 50 pounds and they were reduced to 10 pounds and then the same with the top as well so I got it literally for a bargain I was so excited um so I'm wearing my new PJs I feel great and I did get some other bits as well but I was gonna do like a main channel video like a boxing day sale haul but I know people don't really like hauls anymore so if that is something you want to see and if you will watch it then do let me know down in the comments below um i'm gonna go downstairs now and i'm gonna go show you what i've been making for my breakfast also this dressing gown you may have seen on my what i got for christmas video if you haven't seen it go and check it out my main channel um that casey and nicole got me it and it's the sweetest thing in the world i love it and it's from top shop so let's go so earlier let's see this is no it isn't oh i forgot that i put the raisins in there so they're actually going to be cooked that was a bad mistake i should have put the raisins in after um but i made my own granola because i absolutely love granola and when i go to the shop and i buy it it's always got so much sugar in that it's never actually as healthy as it seems um so i thought i'd make my own healthy granola it looks really yummy apart from the fact that i burnt the raisins love that but apart from that aside from that it looks great so i wanted to have a granola um and then i also have some like frozen fruit and i was gonna have yogurt for my breakfast but i forgot to buy some yogurt when i was at the shop me being me so i'm gonna have something else i think i might just have maybe scrambled eggs for breakfast um yeah maybe like scrambled eggs on toast or something like that i really wish i had avocado i'm really sad that I don't. I'm also going to have to sit and pick out every single raisin because they're burnt and basically what happened is I made the granola, I took it out and then I put the raisins on top and then after I was like actually I don't think it's cooked enough so I put it back in and then that's why the raisins are now in with the granola but I think it's going to be really yummy but yeah now i just have loads of burnt raisins and i don't have any yogurt i've now got on a little bit of makeup and i've changed i haven't actually managed to get any bottoms on yet i'm still in my pj shorts and it's halfway through the day but basically i just finished filming a video of my mum so that'll be on my channel very soon in fact actually it's my video for this sunday and i really like it i think you guys are gonna enjoy it it's one that's been requested for so 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 long now so look out for that video now i need to tidy up i need to put my lights and stuff away and then i want to go through a few of these drawers here especially my gym drawer because i've bought a lot of new gym stuff recently and i got some new running stuff for christmas so i want to basically sort basically throw out my old stuff i don't really wear because 
there's there's so much thin stuff in there that I just literally do not wear anymore just because I find it uncomfy or whatever it might be. I feel like I really want to sort that drawer out because I constantly keep wanting to buy new gym stuff. I don't even have room for it. Right, so this here is my gym drawer that I can never, this is the situation every time, is I can never open it because it is just too much stuff inside so i'm gonna have to get everything out and then decide what i want to keep and what i want to throw away. well not throw away but give to a charity shop i might just be able to shut it hang on no hang on still so full i'm honestly so excited because my mum gave me this um mini joe malone candle that she got in her advent calendar and it's my favorite joe malone smell it's the pomegranate noir and it smells amazing so thank you mum i did light it this morning but i definitely want to light it again because it smells insane my mum gave it to me because it's my favorite and she knows that but also it's actually her least favorite so I feel like at some point today I really should get out my dressing gown but I just feel like that's not really gonna happen. I am going to sit here with my laptop and actually do some editing. I'm going to edit the video that I filmed my mum today so we can get up in time for Sunday so it isn't late like it normally is. So Sunday at 5pm this video will be live and I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna hopefully try and edit all of it now. this girl has decided to get out of her dressing gown and it was a really hard move but I plan on going out for dinner with my friend Grace today so we're gonna go for Nando's literally though I kept like putting off the time it's now like half past seven I don't even know how that happened it's because I just finished editing my video and by the way I love it so I can't wait for you guys to go and see Sunday's video um, I'll show you what I'm wearing but it's it's nothing special. This is the top that I wore on my recent video and I put like an Instagram story of me wearing this top. Everybody keeps asking me where it's from. So it is actually from Miss Selfridge and I did get it in the sale. Um, and then my Balenciaga scarf. This um, bomber jacket I got from Misguided and I love it. My scrunchie, I can't remember where this is from, sorry. These joggers that are my favourite thing in the world. They're like really cool because they've got like pockets and also they make your they make your bum look good from behind because they have like two zips under your bum. Anyways, I love them but I got them from like a boutique in LA and then I've just got on some big trainers. This is my outfit. Very chilled, no one to impress in Nando's, so let's go. I always get a question, so this is the gloss that I'm wearing, and it is called, it's not going to focus, but Boy Bay, and then also my favourite one by Urban Decay, and this one, it doesn't want to say what it's called, it's called Midnight Cowgirl. <laughs> Mum's spending her evening by, she's stolen my lap tray. She's got her dinner, her wine, and she's also watching um, one of my favourite movies this year, Bird Box. Definitely recommend. Look who I'm doing this. How busy is it in here? Oh, it's so busy. We've seen about 50 people that we yeah. know, and we both look great. So great. We're like trying to vlog on the down low, honestly. And also, they have the chocolate frozen yogurt, and we're both like, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna have that after. Yeah. I have gone all out today. <laughs> right, for anyone, thank you. For anyone thinks that like I'm starving myself or whatever else, I'm not. I just had loads of veg before I left with gravy. Oh, and so like I was really full ready, but then we and we planned to go to Nando's, so loads of veg, so <laughs> shut up. No, we're gonna have frozen yogurt after and I can't wait. And it's chocolate, the best. Now this right here. Is what we're talking about. Yes, please. Just walked back through the door and it was so, so, so lovely seeing Grace. Um, I actually had such a nice catch up. If you guys have been following the vlogs for quite a while, you know I went away on a holiday with Grace and it was so weird because we, we have such busy lives, separate lives, that we didn't see each other for so long after. So I feel like I had a proper catch up with her today, which is really nice. We've been in Nando's for like two hours. Um, I'm now going to wash off my makeup and basically get ready for bed and look exactly what I look like this morning. I guess I'll show you a little bit of my makeup routine and I also need to wash off all my tan. It's time to remove my makeup so I'm gonna shove my hair up. Oh gosh look at that. that is literally the biggest bun I've ever seen. I literally look like I've got family five in my head but I'm gonna wash my makeup and do my skincare routine now. When it comes to washing my face recently I've been using this by Lizelle. Really, really, really just like um, scrub my nose now. I never really used to do this. Um, 
but I've started getting a lot of blackheads on my nose and stuff where I've never done it recently um, and I need to get rid of them so oh my god I just got some in my mouth so this is the way that I'm doing it I mean this face wash is amazing but probably not for getting rid of blackheads but it is amazing so I need to actually wash off my tan as well but I'm just gonna wash it all off in the morning I know I really should wash off now but it's getting really late and I just can't be off to have a shower so all my face makeup did um, remove from the face wash, but then I just had some eye makeup left over. Um, so I literally just got some eye makeup remover and then wiped it off with some pads. So this was the eye makeup remover that I used and it's by Boots. I know we can't really get hold of Tarte in the UK because obviously it's an American brand, but this is one of my absolute favourite ever moisturizers it's amazing 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 and i can't recommend it enough so if you ever get the chance to get your hands on it if you ever go to sephora or anything like that then definitely do recommend this is the h2o just add water and this is the moisturizer that i'm going to be using today no i didn't just do that okay then how many people just died laughing and the worst part is, because I have tan on, oh my god, yes then. And do you know what, it's so expensive, I don't even care that I'm wiping it off my boot. I'm still going to get it off the lid, and I'm still going to use it on my face. <laughs> okay everyone, I am now ready for bed, so I'm going to end this vlog here. I hope you guys did enjoy. Look out for Sunday's video because I absolutely love it. I've just finished uploading it and I can't wait for you guys to see it. Um, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys very, very, very soon. Mwah. Bye.